very good day to our lecturer, Dr. Diana, and all my classmates for the subject of AKU 3201. Today, we as the members of Group 4 will present to you on recycling system. There are five members in the group, which is myself, Adam, Tan, Juanesh, Asran, Ayman, and Shivana. Without further ado, I will proceed with our presentation. Recycling system, also known as Recirculating Aquaculture System, RAS. RAS is a technology where water is recycled back into the culture tank to be reused after mechanical and biological filtration and removal of suspended matter and metabolites. This method is used for high density culture of various species of fish utilizing minimum land area and water. It is suitable for home aquarium and for fish production where water exchange is limited and the use of biofiltration is required to reduce ammonia toxicity. Okay, uh, thank you and moving on. So I will be sharing the advantages of RAS. RAS uses uh, a low water usage. The limited amount of water is beneficial. Let me take an example. There are some countries that the water is a limited resource. So the farmers can use uh, this system to produce food production and also conserve uh, water. It is also uh, an easier and a cheaper way. Uh, RRS can be considered a most environmental friendly way to produce fish. Secondly, it is easier to control the parameters. Controlling parameters such as water temperature, oxygen level and daylight and etc. Which again, it gives less stress and better growth. This uh, stable condition results in a steady and forcible growth pattern that enables the farmers to precisely predict when the fish will have reached a certain stage or size. Easier words to say is that the farmers can identify the fish are suitable to harvest or not. And thirdly, the risk of disease is low. Disease is a major aspect to be mentioned. The impact of pathogen is lowered considerably in a recirculation system as invasive disease from outside environment are minimized by the limited use of water because uh, traditional fish farming is taken from uh, river, lake or sea which naturally increase the risk of dragging in disease. In fact, RAS do not have any problem with uh, disease and the use of medicine is therefore reduced significantly is, uh, for the benefits of the production and the environment. Thank you. Alright, next I will talk about the rust design and the functional part of rust that is included. That is, growing tanks, some of particular removable device, biofilters, oxygen injection with YouTube aeration, and water circularization pump. Depending on a water temperature, a fish species selected, a water heating system may be necessary. Ozone and ultraviolet circularization also may be advantageous to reduce organic and bacterial loads. Water supply is a good thing that is must educated in both quality and quantity is essential to a successful farming enterprise. Rust or otherwise, grounded water obtained from the deep wells or sparing the best source of the fish water culture. It generally is a free of pollens and have relative high hardness levels which is beneficially under some sisterization. Many couples water supplies also can be used after chlorinite, fluoride, and the chemicals are removable. 
other sources of water, particularly surface water from the streamers, rivers, ponds and lakes are not recommended for fish culture. Surface waters may be contain fish disease, parasites, pesticides and other pollens that can kill or slow down the growth of the fish. Testing the quantity and quality of the available water supply is one of the first steps of the protection first fish farmers to take in secure and adequate supply for high quality water. That is the some things that is open and closed system. Tank culture system are referred to the recyclization that is closed system because the recycles or reuse water. No system is ever completely closed because some water must be added periodically to replace evaporation losses and the uses of the flush out wasted materials. Some water changes is necessary since no filter is 100% effective. Nevertheless, rust can operate effectually by accumulates adding on relatively small amounts of water and daily or weekly schedules. So next, I will present about challenges in recycling system. In doing something, we certainly do not run away from facing challenges. The same goes for the recycling system, which is rust. In the use of recycling system, there are several challenges. Among them are technological sustainability and economic sustainability. Rust is a te technology-based system. Nowadays, many 100% monitor where every single value, data or modification can be seen or watched online as a big brother's eye. In terms of technological sustainability, the technology designed by engineers, which is with the aid of the managers in charge, could be analyzed using this question. What characteristic of sustainable development inform the design process? What sustainability impacts or effects are caused by the technology? Who or what was affected? Where and when? Could the designer have foreseen these consequences? How did the designer judge and anticipate them? How was societal interaction dealt with during the design process? In general, the sustainability assessment begins in the farm, but how the te technology was produced or how much waste is generated by such technology is important as it is also part of the product production. Next, econo economical sustainability. Rust are expensive, usually require costly indoor spaces and have continuous and substantial operational requirements beyond less intensive methods. Moreover, the cost of labor and energy can be prohibitively high depending on the location. The production location influences the competitiveness of the aquaculture farm by conditioning environmental impacts and economic expenditure factors. For instance, and any comparison between different rust production may not be realistic as many factors. For an example, species, country, production volumes and policies affect the result obtained. A clear dimension and perspective of economics of scale needs to be considered if affordable operational costs and consistent marketable final product prices are intended in the given in the given location of the system or company. We are looking for a balance between operational costs and production benefits. Rust management and understanding affect their performance and consequently industry success. Moreover, the, the investment required and the long payback period seem to be the greatest constraint. Thus, a good market study is required in order to plan an affordable and realistic production goal. Nonetheless, the first requirement will be a reliable operation followed by low operating cost. So moving on to the next point, which is the general consideration or is also known as the factors that should be taken place during the designing of the system. So firstly, we should also focus on the availability of supplemental water where the quality and temperature of water should always be constant and maintained. Secondly is the disposal of effluent water. So effluent water is technically made up of three types of water which is known as the rinsing water and the purification unit, washing water containing disinfectant 
certain uh, chemicals and lastly is the sewage water so sewage and washing water can be connected um, can be connected into the sewage system or also collected and then dispose it off while washing water should be neutralized before disposing it and the last point is the energy supply thermal and electric so to provide thermal energy it is advised to use the cheap natural hydrothermal um, hydrothermal or industrial waste heat energy from the effluent water of power station where is possible and if the quality of the natural thermal water is not suitable for the fish culture it should be utilized with a heat exchange or heat pump where a two directional electric energy supply or motor generator backup unit will ensure a continuous operation of the system so these are the three factors that uh, should be concentrated or should be taken uh, taken uh, take focused on before designing the system and so far this is the points from me under general consideration and that is all from our group thank you